How are you? Very well, thank you. My name is Adina Porter. Adina, it's nice to meet you. We're very familiar with you and your work, so. Thank you. Yes, we're big fans. So talk a little bit about, you know, just what this show means, not only to you, but what it means for everyone who's watching and a part of the experience. Mm, I feel privileged to be part of Underground. Um, it's an exciting show. Uh, uh, Misha and Joe, the creators, talked about how these characters are superheroes. Yes. And, um, you know, sometimes the victor, sometimes the victors get to write history, so there might be some tales here that you didn't know about, mm -hmm. that people who will experience this will know about. Um, was there anything that you learned in particular, let's say, about Harriet Tubman? I mean, obviously, this, she was a real breathing, living, loving person. Is there any attribute about her that stuck out to you that you learned about her? I mean, I knew that she was brave. Yeah. Uh, I knew that she was fierce. Breathtaking. <laughs> <laughs> I think that sometimes, you know, we like to kind of think that um, peaceful transition. Yes. She was. <laughs> She wasn't. For sure. She carried a gun and used it well. For sure. So that's what I. I kind of knew that. Hi. <laughs> now I know for sure. Absolutely. Especially the way I used to Yeah. I love love watching her uh, just embody that character. When it comes to you know you having a stage play background, you came from theater. Um, how important is it that we have stories like Fences being told by people like August Wilson? And, and what are your thoughts about just what we're, what you're seeing right now in, in Hollywood? I feel very privileged. I mean, I... Whenever I watch an old black and white movie, I think, oh, okay, it's a great movie, but thank God I wasn't born then because I would be playing as the main. Mm. But I'm also glad that I don't have to, at this moment, only play positive Mike. role models. You know, last season on um, what's that show? Julia. 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 American Horror Story. Oh yes. I played a murderer. <laughs> <laughs> so um, I, I love that I can uh, have the diversity to play all different kinds of roles. Yes. You know, the world was watching the Oscars a few nights ago. Uh, what were your thoughts just, you know, about that moment when, um, you know, the moment when, you know, then, I mean, what were your thoughts about that? And, and what a lot of people are saying now that, you know, in a lot of ways that that was disrespectful for the for the Academy to do that. I mean, what were your thoughts and what's the what's the bigger picture that's going on here? Do you feel like there is one? I think it was, I think it was an honest mistake. I think there's a PA whose business, whose career is over mm -hmm. now. Um, I think it was gracious the way that um, uh, Mr. Horowitz handled it. Um, so I, I think it was an honest, honest mistake, and uh, I just I don't think it takes anything away from how uh, magnificent a film Moonlight is, yeah. and the fact that a film that cost a million point five to make yep. beat out front <laughs> runner. Yeah. Speaks volumes. Uh, Oh, yes. And it will be remembered yeah, all yeah, well. For sure. Well, thank Karen. you so much for your work. I forgot about you, Diane. I didn't forget oh, about you. Take care. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. Oh. Okay, yes. Maybe like season nine or something. Yeah.